So I've got a little haul for you today, nothing overly exciting, just a couple of bits that I've picked up recently that I thought I would share with you. And the first thing was I went into Superdrug because I wanted to get a new concealer and I went in intending to get the Maybelline Fit Me concealer because everyone has been saying how amazing that is for your under eye area, but they didn't have it. They just didn't have any of the Maybelline Fit Me concealers at all, just the foundations and the powder. So I needed the new concealer because I'd finished my um, Collection 2001 and none of the others that I've got at the moment were cutting it so I repurchased the collection 2001 which looks like this I am wearing it under my eyes today I love this the only thing is I purchased it in number three which is medium which is the shade that I purchased last time but for some reason I feel like it's a little bit lighter at the moment and I'm not sure how I feel about that but nonetheless I love the coverage it gives and it is a very kind of foolproof product then I also picked up two cream blushes because I seem to be addicted to buying NUA makeup lately. Every time I go in there, there's just things that I haven't noticed and I just think they've really got nice lip and cheek products going on. So I picked up two. I know that's a little bit naughty because I said I wasn't going to buy any more makeup for a while, but... I picked two up and I've never tried any of their cream blushes so I was really excited. This one is in Scrummy and I'm wearing this on my face today. This is what it looks like. I'm wearing it on my cheeks right now. Kind of pretty nice warm apricotty colour. And then this one is Lush and this is kind of like a nice bright pink colour. They're very pigmented. Um, I'll swatch it here and show you. They're very pigmented and they kind of do feel a little bit greasy um, when you kind of touch it but it dries really nicely onto your skin. That's what it looks like and if I blend it out on the back of my hand you can kind of see it is very pigmented and it just leaves a nice kind of pretty sheen so I picked those up and then the other thing that I wanted to pick up was a new purse because I had bought myself one just a Primark kind of nude cute purse but I didn't like it and I just wasn't feeling it so I was in Primark on Oxford Street and the Primark there is amazing it's not even like going into Primark it's like being in River Island but Anyway, I saw this purse and I hadn't ever seen it before and I picked it up and I love it. It's just this kind of nice um, dark kind of bluey green colour and it's the nice shape that I like where you get this kind of bit here to put your change in and then you've got kind of nice a studding detail here and some quilting. Open it up and we've kind of got cards and that kind of thing in there. So I really, really like that. And then I also got a Topshop voucher for my birthday and I'd ordered a really cute dress today. The dress arrived and it was too big so I couldn't wear it. So I did a little bit more damage in Topshop and purchased a few things. But first of all, I have got this right here which I ordered from ASOS. And I ordered it and again it came and it was too big and I had to send it back. First time I've ever returned anything to ASOS and I've got to say their return service is pretty good. But I bought this um, maxi dress because I haven't got, well I have got a black maxi dress but I've worn it a lot and it's kind of looking a bit tatty. So I bought this one right here. I know it's really difficult to show a maxi dress on camera but this is what the front looks like. Just kind of vest detailing. It's kind of nice t-shirt material, fairly form fitting and... It's got a little slit up the back. It's not exactly what I wanted, but it was very inexpensive, so I don't really mind. But um, I wanted one that was kind of very fitted at the top and then just billows out a little bit, but from nice t-shirt material. And they're really hard to find. The shape in maxi dresses is a difficult thing to get right. So I do like this, I will keep it. It was only around four pounds, it doesn't really matter, but it is just something to bear in mind. I did order something else from my sister as well that I sent back and asked for a refund because it's I'm gonna see what other prints they do in this and pick up a couple more, but this is what the vest top looks like. So it's just a kind of loose vest top gathered under your bust, and then the trousers kind of just are sort of three quarter length trousers. I do, would prefer them to be longer, but it's not the end of the world. But they're purple with little um, bird prints on them, and I think they're really, really cute. And then, last but not least, my Topshop purchases. I picked up a couple of bits from the sale with my gift card and I bought this cardigan which isn't necessarily super me-ish but I just thought it was a little bit different. It's this kind of pale grey lilac -y colour with woven glitter inside it and I wore it last week and I do really really like it and I do think it's really cute. And then I also bought this blouse um, from there as well which is just this lovely navy, oh that's the back. Right. It's this beautiful um, navy blouse, but it's got kind of like a pussy bow um, here, you're supposed to tie it like that, I wouldn't do that, I like it kind of down here, and to just wear a nice vest underneath it, nice billowy sleeves, and I think that's really, really pretty. I will. It will be a bit too cold for me to wear at the moment, but um, 
yeah, I'm really looking forward to wearing that. So those are the few things that I picked up. Nothing overly exciting, just a few little bits and bobs, but I always get requests to do more hauls, so I thought I would share that with you. I hope you enjoyed this. Again, please don't forget to let me know what you think about the lighting and the quality. I'm really, really pleased with it. I've got a huge light right here, so I'm kind of a bit like, but um, I'm really pleased with it. So yeah, I hope you are too, and I will see you all in my next video.